Did you know that more than 300 million people suffer from depression as reported by the World Health Organization? Did you also know that cryotherapy can be used to help with depression? In this article, we will show you how cryotherapy helps with depression. What is depression? In our daily lives, we are familiar with feelings such as sadness, feeling down, having a loss of interest or pleasure daily. However, when these feelings persist for more than two weeks, it might as well be the depression that's troubling you. Many people have problems reporting early signs of depression, not knowing that it could save their lives. In this day, people have a, developed a stigma towards others who suffer from this condition, sometimes calling them weak and unwilling to fight. But this is a serious condition that can affect everyone, thereby causing serious health conditions like high blood pressure and headaches. The most devastating result that comes out of a depression on the economic side is the loss of desire to perform our everyday activities, thus disturbing our cycle of life and affecting productivity. On your health side, effects such as back pains, muscle aches, and constant fatigue cause your body to never function really well. However, in this day and age, you do not have to worry much about developing symptoms of depression, as long as you acknowledge its presence because there are ways you can deal with depression, such as cryotherapy. Cryotherapy is defined as a cold therapy that is designed to bring the body's temperatures down at tissue and cellular levels. It helps the body with metabolism and other athletic performance related advantages. More so, cryotherapy can assist depressed people to get back to their normal routines, especially when performed on the brain. Can cryotherapy help with depression? Exposing the brain to cold has been proven to have deep effects such as how it helps with the levels of hormone and neurotransmitter norepinephrine responsible for vigilance, attention, focus, and positive mood, which increases distinctly each time your body is exposed to extreme cold conditions. Looking at the above products of norepinephrine such as vigilance, attention, focus, and positive mood, we discover that this treatment with cryotherapy helps a great deal in dealing with depressed people. With norepinephrine, it just does not only help depressed people go back to their jovial moods or help them concentrate at work, but also does help in the prevention of cancer, especially the one that's associated with inflammation. Norepinephrine, released during cryotherapy, is responsible for decreasing the levels of tumor necrosis alpha which is a pro-inflammatory cytokine. This is very instrumental in promoting systematic inflammation in humans. Inflammation also is known for affecting aging people. Hence, these are encouraged to take more cryotherapy sessions as a preventative measure against such diseases as cancer, arthritis, and many others. In conclusion, depression is a known killer in the world, and it is known to affect more women than men. Even if it is that, both men and women are encouraged to be checked by the doctor every time they feel symptoms of depression for over two weeks. Remember also to book for cryotherapy at your nearby facility.